This was bound in 1682 by a medical student uh, who was studying medicine in Paris. He was a Spaniard um, and didn't know anyone, so he was going to theater. Um, he went to see a play called Liberon, which he liked so much he bought a copy in sheets. A short time later, uh, the actress who had performed in this uh, appeared on his autopsy table. And the only way uh, the only way you end up in an autopsy theater in 1682 is if your body's unclaimed. And he knew that when they were done, she would go into a mass grave and be lost forever. So he took it upon himself to take a section of her back, process it to parchment, and bind what is most likely the last place she performed in, in her skin. This is unusual in, on, in a number of ways, in that A, it's a play. Um, it was bound much earlier than most of them, 1682, uh, and it stayed with the same family. Um, it stayed with the same family from its binding. Uh, it actually came to me with a, with a note which read, uh, Dear Mr. Khan, my family has had a book bound in human skin since my ancestors bound it in 1682. We've decided that it should come to market and we're told we should contact you, which I have to admit was probably the best email I've ever received in my life. I don't expect it to be topped.